Yo, what is going on guys, Vortex Gaming here, and welcome to Season 3, Episode 2 of Life At. Um, and yeah, we're going to play the first game of the season in today's episode. Um, we'll go through pre-season now. I don't think of what to say there. Um, yeah, we'll go through pre-season. Not, not very long pre-season. Only four games. Would have been five, but I cancelled the last one. It was only like two days before our first game of the season. Um, mixed bag of results. Three under-21s games. Uh, one nil win over QPR. Reserves. A three all draw against Wigan Reserves. We went 3-0 down, I think, and then brought it back. Uh, two nil defeat against Millwall, which was disappointing, and a three one defeat against Partick Thistle, which was also very disappointing. Um, so yeah, not the greatest preseason, but I'm not too fussed. Um, obviously, preseason doesn't really reflect on the season you're going to have most of the time. I find um, transfers not a lot has happened, to be honest. Um, say that we brought brought in five players um first one callum willock none of these players are outstanding i should say um this guy also seems to be a coach i don't remember signing him to be to be perfectly honest um then we had Ahmed dean who i also don't really remember signing um but it's been a while since i played this save so he's sierra leonean is that how you say that i don't know good tackling decent pace and acceleration should be alright. Uh, next one, David King. Again, I don't remember signing any of these players. I remember signing the last two, but I don't remember signing the first three. Um, so then, George Purcell, um, who I really like. I think he's a lot better than my assistant makes out. Um, yeah, we got him on loan from AFC Hornchurch. We're paying £8 a week of his wages. Um so yeah, good determination, good good pace, good stamina, good finishing. Uh, hopefully, he'll fit into our system. And Louis Fazak Fazakali, Fazakali, pretty well rounded. Not the best player in the world. Not even the best player in this division, but um, he's on a non-contract. So obviously, he's not. We're not paying his wages. And um, players that went out. Ugo Adoji, uh, unfortunately, I think he's a pretty good player. Um, he's actually the reason we had to bring in Fazakurli. Fazakurli. But yeah, next, Michael Freighter. Um, not sure why he got released, if I'm completely honest. Um, I think his contract just ran out, so. I mean, I wasn't really at the club for long, so these two, I think, were confirmed before I actually got to the club, which was a shame because they're not bad players. Um, you may be wondering what shape we're going with this season. I can't remember what shape we went with last season, but we're going to go with a 4-3-1-2. Um, not sure what to use my... Attacking midfield around, so I think I'm going to go with a deep line forward rather than a defensive forward. Um, and I'm actually going to start George Purcell. No, I'm not going to start him. I won't start him. I'll put him on the bench instead of David King. There you go. So we'll go with that. We'll see how that does in our first game of the season, which is against Maidenhead. Now, our board expectation, I should say, is mid table. Um, honestly, I'm not sure if we're going to be able to do that or not. It's not that I don't have faith in the team. It's that I don't really have faith in myself on this game. Um, because I'm not... I'll be honest, I'm not very good at football manager this year. Really not enjoying it, but we'll see what we can do. Um, Van der Hyde playing left, right back this game. Which is weird, because I thought the other guy was better but my assistant doesn't seem to think so um so yeah oh they're gonna score aren't they oh no good save Lumley. 
then again, if that had have gone in, I would have been extremely disappointed. Oh, I thought he was going to play over the top then. Andrews, Richie's in. Oh. Oh. That is, that is outrageously bad. Right. Come on, boys. We can still win this. No, we can't. Because I have had no luck whatsoever in coming from behind in competitive matches on FM15. So it looks like this game is already finished. They're going to get another goal here, I think. Good tackle, Everett. And then a long ball forward. Which their defence kind of half clears. Oh, Hanks, what a finish, lad. I can guarantee if there's another goal, Maidenhead will score it. In the whole game, not just the first half. So, half time, 1 1. Um, we can still get a win. Do I want to leave it as it is? Yeah. Um, take that off. Right. Let's see how that does. I mean, we haven't really changed anything, but... You know. Maybe if we start getting a, more shots away, instead of trying to work it into the box, you know, we might get a lucky shot on target or something. And that's Andrew's injured. Great. Um... Tell you what, we'll bring George Purcell on. We'll put Richie in attacker midfield. Um, we'll see how George does. Ex York player, actually, George Purcell. Didn't play many games for us, but he did play. <laughs> Downer. Um, bring on David Ijaya. Ijaha. And tell you what, we'll bring on physically. I'm going to have trouble saying that. We're going to bring on Louis. Come on, boys. Ijaha, physically. Richie. Oh, it's in. No, wait. Nah, that didn't cross the line. That did not cross the line. No, go back. Surely this did not cross the line. How do you like? Oh, we got away with that one, boys. Goal line technology says no goal. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Goal line technology. We need it. <laughs> Actually, no. What am I saying? No, no. It's a good thing we don't have goal line technology. But just to review, no goal. <laughs> I'm so lucky. There's no way that's over the line. Absolutely no way. How can the assistant not see that? He's got a clear line of sight on it. Then again, let's... should we see it in full time? In, like, full speed? Oh, he must have seen that. There's no way he didn't see that that was it wasn't over the line. They're gonna score straight from the kickoff, aren't they? Oh, oh, y yeah. Oh no, Hanks. Hanks. All right, no, no. We're playing for this point. We're playing. In fact, no. We want to keep the ball. We are gonna drop deeper though. Waste time. Close down much more. I'm not really going to exploit anywhere. Um, tight marking. Get stuck in. More disciplined. The positions. There we go. Right, we're going to hold on for this. these three points. Come on, boys. No. Nah. Nah. No, surely not. Come on, boys. Oh, we shot. Come on, boys. Come on, counter, counter. Hanks, get it in the box. 
Oh yeah! Yes! Come on! Yes! Finally! I can't remember the last episode we actually won a game. I know for a fact we didn't win. We haven't won in the last three game episodes. Come on, boys! Nah, we ain't gonna get a fourth, surely. Go on, physically. Oh, Louis, it's a poor cross, mate. Get in. Come on, boys. Up the haze. 3 1. Very good victory. Happy with that. Look at that, we dominated them. Wow. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Let's go. Absolutely scary. Absolutely thrashed them. Opening day of the season at their ground. Thrashed them. How many cards did we get? Because we might get fined for that. That's only three. It's fine. Absolutely thrashed them. Yes, boys. That's what we've wanted. Finally. I'm not going to say my luck's turning around. but Oh, look. Jenkinson's gone to West Brom. Great move for him. 3-1. Get in, lads. Get in. Fucking scenes. Hashtag scenes. Tweet it. Tweet it out. Hashtag scenes. Um, so that's that. Yes, boys. I'm loving that. I'm loving the goal that wasn't actually a goal as well. Um... Yeah, our attacking midfielder actually is only rated five grey stars. So, his dribbling's good, though. He's actually pretty good. I don't get why he's not rated that well. He's got good dribbling. Decent passing. Good technique. His finishing ain't bad. He's determined. His teamwork isn't bad. Work rate's pretty good. I don't get why he's only rated... F My assistant manager must be terrible. He's rated better than that, surely. He must be better than that. Who's our next best attacking centre mid? I'm no, it's not Luke Bursey, is it? I'm sure we had an injured player. Oh, that oh that's him. So, who who would we compare him to? I guess Luke Bursey, who is nowhere near his quality, <laughs> nowhere near, and they're rated like one star off each other, nah, he's better than that, he's probably one of the better players on the team to be fair, who is our best player, by interest, this guy apparently, hmm, I may have hired the wrong man as my assistant manager, so yeah it's better, Anyway, what a result to start the season. 3-1. One. one of the goals wasn't actually a goal, but get in, boys. So, um, after the first game of the season, I'll find the fucking league table. This is what I miss. Do you remember when you could, like... Okay. Do you remember when you could just, like, click the competition and it would take you straight to the league table? That was great. So, oh, okay. <laughs> Ranting about nothing. Um, yeah, good win to start the season, 3-1. Um, and we're in second, which is weird. Um, yeah, we're a maiden ahead. I have to ask, don't I? You know, that's not how you do it. That's how you do it. Maiden head, sixth. Okay, we're predicted to finish 11th, but that's not the point. So, yeah, good start to the season. Um, that's it, really. Don't know when the next episode will be. Um, maybe East? No, because uh, it's only the second qualifying round. Maybe Margate? I've got a mate who lives in Margate, so that could be a good episode to do. So, yeah, Margate will be the next episode. Um, and hopefully we can pick up six wins between them. That's not six, is it? That's five. Five wins between them. Um, so yeah, if you've enjoyed the video, please leave a like. 
that'd be great. Um, and obviously, let us know what you think of the video. Um, here we go. What was it? Was it a goal? Was it a goal? Let us know what you think. I don't think it was. I think it should have been disallowed. Would have changed the whole game. But um, obviously, I'm glad it was allowed. But it shouldn't have been allowed. Um, so yeah, that's it. Thank you very much for watching, guys. I'll see you in the next episode. Peace.